What is up? Good morning, my adventure crew. Nick Morris here. Welcome to another episode of Real Adventures Hawaii. If it's your first time here, welcome aboard. If you're back, welcome back aboard. Fishing Hollywood today is just me and Monster Matt. It's dark. I'm glad I brought my light. So if you film earlier in the morning now, we have to wait till the sun's up to film. Uh, but it's only 5.04. We're going to set lines. We're about 10 miles out already. It's supposed to be flat water today. I don't even know what the game plan is. But, uh... I don't know, still, the moon phase isn't just right yet. I think my next week's video, the moon phase will be perfect, so we'll see. It's only like a day after a full moon right now. See if we get lucky, um, I don't know, maybe tuna fish. If not, we're gonna look for rubbish. It's gonna be flat, but definitely look for otaru or whatever we can find. But if it is your first time here, we post new videos every Sunday, 7 p.m. Hawaii time. We're gonna run six lines. Hundred percenter, purple snow globe, nine inch blue, blue jet, blueberry cup. So our short corner, we're gonna run the on the corner. We're gonna run the the nine inch jet that caught the eye the last couple of videos. On the short corner, we'll probably run a twelve inch cherry bomb for fun. Uh, blue snow globe cherry bomb, but. Let's get the lines out and we'll see after the sun comes up. We forgot almost one of the most important things before we started fishing. The musubi. If you gotta get something, you gotta give something. You gotta feed the sea god. He loves spam musubis. Spam, rice, seaweed. Oh my god, this right here is the one. This is what you need to catch fish, telling you now. If you're not doing this, you need to start doing it. All right, there we go, now we can start fishing. All right, let's get the lines in the water now. All right, so we got our lines out, we're trolling now. Today is a beautiful day, it's flat. Now we just gotta find the fish. Hopefully we can find some rubbish today. I like to find rubbish, flat water. We love to find rubbish today. There you go, for the dream, let's hope we can get lucky today. Something, 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 something today. Let's get some action! Some, some, some Red Bull rocks start pretty soon. Alright, we'll see you guys shortly. Right now is 5.45 a.m. We'll see you back here before 7 hopefully. Seven forty-five, about 20, 20 miles from the harbor. And I kept looking at the binos. I kept seeing some of the white bounce up and down. I was like, I see a bird sitting in the water. It's buoys. It's kind of far. I could barely make it out. It's almost even the water line. And now that I'm able, a quarter of my way from the binos, I was like, that looks like buoys. I don't know. It could be, it could be, uh, could be birds, but I think it's buoys. We'll still get a little closer. I don't know. We'll see. The kind of buoys that was like three or four videos back. Those caliper looking buoys, but I don't know. Hope for the best. Hope for the best. We got lots of bait. I hope it's buoys. See shortly, guys. About 20 yards out. You see a big cargo net. I love what I see so far. Let's see if we get a knockdown off of it. The car went in, huh? Yeah. Oh, we have a booties, huh? Yeah. That right there could be what Jim's in need of! Find out real fast. We are first pass by going up sea end. Nothing. We're going to go down sea by now. Let's see if something's here. Hopefully. See at the rubbish, see at the rubbish. See what it looks like.
I got overly excited. I got a little bit of a tangle. So we're gonna get another pass down to One more pass went down to we should be good, we'll see. Let's say there's much fish on, let's say only like hoggies, what we call it Hawaii hoggies, but to me I call it trigger fish. But it's all we see, so it's gotta be a pretty old rubbish. Let's say it doesn't look like color, let's say ropes with two buoys on it. But I'm not gonna work past down sea by nothing rod here. Look for something else. But yeah, flat, flat, flat there. No white caps. So it makes it a little easier to find rubbish. If there's waves or white caps, it'd be pretty hard to find something like that unless you ran it over. There's no way you find something like that unless you ran it over. Alright, let's go back up. One more pass for the boys and girls. Thumbs up if you want to see a strike, because I know I do. 801. Let's get a strike. 100% over! Clear out, man! Clear lines, man! Let me get down there. I think you ran it so far, right? Yeah. Got an eye on. Hundred percenter. You bend your fast. Hello, the bank stick. You want me to leave? You gonna bang on them? Yeah. I should be getting deep color soon on it. Size on, huh? Size on. Yeah. 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 He's dead! He's dead, baby! Victory dance <laughs> once again. Yeah, he's good, eh? the knife. Yeah. Oh, he's so good. What's his hooks at? What is that, Nick? Honor for center, boy! Yeah. for center, baby. Oh, night, night. Oh, night, night. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, we better not, we better not shoot it outside at all. I was like, we're gonna see outside. You know, I forget. Came up hot, bro. When he came up, and I landed all chips right here. I said, ah, oh, I gotta keep it on. Doing some work. Poo poo. Good morning, Nick! That's why we do what we do! <laughs> 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 
That's all right. 100% center. Does it again. Take the shell out, no? Huh? I'm going to take the shell out. You can keep the shell? Yeah, I'll keep the shell. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go down C. We're going to set lines. Uh, Go down C because right now we're in the trough. Go down C. We're going to set lines. We'll leave them out on the deck for now. And then after we get down the line set back up, we'll get them and get them and get them on ice. And I'll show you how we do that. Hit the thumbs up. Hit the subscribe if you're new here. We post new videos every Sunday. 7 p.m. Hawaii time, boys. All right, let's go get the lines out. I want to show you that because it's, nobody wants it's boring. Nobody wants to explain lines out. It's like catch you fish. So let's kill and cut them. Cut the belly up all the way to the, the fan, right? The gills. Inside there. So I'm cut. I should be on my gun into this because I don't want to get all dirty, but. Put this at all. I look like that membrane right there by his gills. Everything should come out. Should be it. That's about it. Pretty simple. Nothing's crazy. So we cut on the plate right over here. Cut the membrane inside there where it attacks the gills. When you bust it, the, the back doo doo bag area. It'll pull all the way through. Pretty much it, we gonna wash down, put it on ice. Probably let them send it up for about another 10 15 minutes and I'll put them on ice. On the cool on a little bit. But that's pretty much it. Pretty simple. Got the ice busted. Last to get them in there. I'm calling it 102. That's a 106. What do you say now? How big? About 111. 111. I'm 11. calling it 102. All right, let's get them in there. Let's get them in there. It's gonna be a fun part. Alright, there we go. Let's get another one. Got the lures out, got the fish ice good, gilded and gutted. So from bite to back to fishing, 45 minutes. Pretty good, pretty good. What is up everybody? It is 1 o'clock. My shift has been on for about an hour already. Matt's taking a nap. We just went to a nap about 20 minutes ago. And no birds, no boats around, no nothing. Lots of time left. The sun doesn't get to go down to about 7.30, so lots of time left. It's a real late rising tide, so that might actually be a good thing today for the late bite. So we shall see. I mean, they always say, never give up. Never, ever give up. We're going to fish in a box, but you know what? Never give up. We're not done yet. Uh, so, I don't know. We're going to keep going. Hopefully get something. Hopefully I will see you guys soon with a with a fish on. Alright everybody. Thumbs up for good luck. Here we go boys and girls. It's 2.46 right now. Been slow all day today. It's nearly a day after a full moon. Normally a few days before and after a full moon are normally not the best fishing in theory. And it seems like it's pretty dead today. A lot of people I think went home already. It is the weekend, it is a Saturday, but I think a lot of people went home. And uh, scan at the binos like we always do every about 30 minutes scan at the binos. We finally found what looks like the pot of gold. We have a bird pot in front of us about three miles ahead. There's got to be over 100 birds there, maybe 200 birds. So this might be the pile that put some put some weight in the box. It looks like Otaru, hopefully. Big Aku, big skipjack, over 20 pounds. We'll see when we get there, but it's about a good two and a half, three miles in front of us. Probably think that's about... 30 minutes to get there, but for you guys, it'll probably take us uh, five seconds. So, see you guys there.
They're not biting. It's so finicky. Why? Why are they so finicky? Big Pavel Tarus, but they're not biting. That was a good pass, Matt. That was the best pass of the day right there. I got two passes through him and nothing. So, Matt, your turn. See if you get two passes through him. That was his first pass. That was the best pass so far. And nothing. They blew up right there in the boat. Right there, Matt. Stop us. Breaking water right over there. Oh. Uh, Otaru's right there. All single Otaru's right there on the screen. What is this wizardry? Let's pop right next to the lure. You ever had 100 yard bills swim by your boat before? That's what it feels like. See 100 yards just swim away from you. 100, 200, there goes a thousand dollars of their face swimming away one time. They're gonna bite. The tide changes in the vault. 30 minutes, 40 minutes to the top of the tide change. I think right before the tide change, they're gonna go off and we have a small window to make it happen. We're gonna stick them out. Stick them out. Never give up. Never, ever, ever, ever give up. So unfortunately, that pile did not work out. We played with them for, it's 4.30 now, so I don't know what, an hour? They wouldn't bite. We'd see the Otaru, everything. They wouldn't bite, so. I'm not as hard as locked jaw. So we're going to head back down to where we got our Ai. And we're going to try to play that area for the afternoon bite, and hopefully, uh, there's an afternoon bite, and hopefully we can get one more. Hope we get anything, anything. My boat club has a tournament this weekend. It's the old guys versus young guys. And of course, I'm on the young guys team. I can fish tomorrow too, but I'm only gonna fish today, Saturday. I'll probably watch them weigh in their fish tomorrow, whoever brings fish to weigh in. Okay, so we just got lines cleared. The sun has gone down, as you can see. It's about 7.20, and we got about 10 miles to go. So we're gonna push out and we're gonna head in. Hit the thumbs up, hit the like, hit the subscribe, and uh, we'll see you guys, I guess, tomorrow morning all right we have to wear fish for the tournament for my little boat club so, so auntie's gonna hold the camera for us here hold the camera without gills and guts it was 92.2 that's an eye, I think. Oh my God. Andy, what do you think? Was I? eye? We're not asking about your negativity over here. <laughs> That's a sheep. <laughs> what about the fish? You want this fish from the sea? The water's too murky, too hard to see. And the farmer man.